it's Miss Cassie, and we're going to read Discover Octopuses by Helen Foster James. So do you think this is a fiction book or a non-fiction book? Let's see. We have a table of contents and some pictures. All right, let's begin. So many arms. An octopus has eight tentacles or arms. Octo means eight. An octopus might lose an arm. It will grow back over time. The name octopus comes from the fact that the animal has eight arms. Octopuses do not look like any other animal. No other animal has a head, arms, and no other body parts. Its head is called a mantle. So can you find the mantle on this octopus? That's right, this big thing. Octopuses do not have any bones. Their only hard body part is their sharp beak. Octopuses live alone. Even though some are big, they can hide in a seashell or a coconut shell. Octopuses have a good memory. They can even open jars. They are curious, but shy. Have you ever seen an octopus up close? Where did you see one and how did it move? This octopus is hiding in a shell. Octopuses keep safe. Octopuses have many ways to say stay safe. They can change their color quickly. This is called camouflage. This octopus likes to blend into its surroundings. An octopus releases black ink when it is scared or hurt. The ink confuses a predator's sense of smell. It irritates their eyes. That lets the octopus move to safety. This octopus is releasing a black cloud of ink. An octopus can hide in a small crack to keep safe. Predators swim by. They do not see the octopus. This octopus is hiding in a coral reef. It lives off an island in California. Yeah, that's pretty hidden in there, isn't it? Octopuses can bite with their sharp beak. They can move fast. They swim head first. Their tentacles trail behind them. An octopus can also crawl along the ocean floor on two arms. Can you list five interesting facts about octopuses and then share them with your a family member? Octopuses swim head first. Looking at tide pools, octopuses only live in ocean water. They live all over the world. This octopus has crawled onto the beach. Sometimes ocean water gets trapped in little holes in the beach. These pools of water are called tide pools. Look in one closely and you might see an octopus. This octopus from South Africa is in a tide pool. All right, and then we have words. We have a glossary which talks about the words discussed in the book, like predator, an animal that lives by hunting other animals to eat. So we had a table of contents and we had a glossary. Do you think it was a nonfiction or a fiction book? You are correct, a nonfiction book. All right, I hope you enjoyed this book about octopuses. See you later.